Hey, what's up? Jake here. Hi. You saying hi? Hi. Your hair's messy. <laughs> Over this winter, I've noticed that my two roosters I kept out of that batch, uh, they get a little frostbite on their comb because they have a really big, they have a really big comb on top of their head. I don't really want to breed that kind of a comb into my flock. I kind of want to have like, like Wyandots or like Brahmas. They have like a pea comb or like a rose comb. They have like a really short little comb on top of their head so they don't get frostbite on it as easily. Um, little cold, hardier birds. It's kind of early to be hatching out eggs for me because I'll have to be keeping them inside and heated and stuff for a while. But I got a really good deal on some hatching eggs of just some like mixed Brahmas and I'm hoping that we'll get at least one rooster out of that. See. What? See. Yeah. yeah. Fragile hatching eggs. Please handle with care. Well, I've already, uh, I dropped them. I already dropped them on the kitchen floor. So it's kind of past that point and they might be broken. Let's just see. No. Oh, I hope I didn't break. Yeah, I think they're all okay. Wow, look at, ah. Uh, I feel liquid. I think one of them might've broke. Okay, we had one break. But, either way, not a big deal, because I actually only paid for six hatching eggs. That was the price he gave me, it was on six hatching eggs. So they threw in one extra. The problem is, these are supposed to come uh, next week, and we were supposed to get our little incubator first. I don't have the incubator yet. Three days later. We got a package today in the mail on the back porch, and I'm pretty sure that it's probably our incubator. Yeah, because we've been waiting forever for it. In the we end. have. We so, we got hatching eggs in the mail the other day. I already showed you that. And uh, I've just been keeping them on the counter at room temperature. Uh, and we just rotate them every other day. And then this is one of our copper Moran eggs. Yes, it is. Yep. It's our incubator. That's just a cheap one off of the internet. I think this costs like 17 or 18 bucks or something. So I'm not expecting much out of it. So, once that gets up to temperature, we'll put all the eggs in, pointed side down, and then I'm going to mark them with a marker on one side of all of them so that we can rotate the egg maybe once or twice a day. I'm going to mark one side of these eggs. So we know when we're rotating it, which side is which. Point side down. Okay. There we go. Put that warm back up. But yeah, we'll keep you guys updated. As soon as they start hatching, we'll let you know. So, so. Look at it. <laughs> so. <Yeah>. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we've had some. Stop, guys.